everyone welcome to my channel my name is Corey and today I'm going to be making a berry pie okay and I'm going to be using a plastic container this is plastic and for this one you're going to need uh, some of this fiber uh, filling okay polyester fiber this one if you don't have this filling, you can always get one from uh, of an old pillow or no a old cushion or something to use it to make this project. Uh, that's what you can use, but let me see. Take some of this filling off of it and just enough right there for this one. That should be enough filling for that. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and just add some glue to the bottom of my dish here. Just a little bit of glue, not too much glue. Okay. And that's just to hold that down. Okay, once you have that, okay, now you're going to use the same fabric and that I'm going to end up putting this right on top of my dish here. And I'm just going to glue this on here. And I'm just going to put glue around my dish and then I'm just going to Half ways like this, and then I'm going to put the rest of the glue after. To do this, you're going to have to use some of these small little berries, and I got these from Dollar Tree um, from last year. I have not seen them out yet, so hopefully you can find some of these berries to do the berry pie, because they do have the larger ones. I have the bigger ones, but I want to use just the small ones to do this. Okay, and now I'm just going to go ahead and add outside of this oh my, and of course you're going to need some strips okay and of course I might end up using more than one strip now I'm going to be adding this around the edge too and I'm going to be gluing it on um, so I'm going to be doing basically the same way I did the, the my pie crust I mean my apple pie crust one and I'm just gonna put that and then I'm just gonna fold it a little bit like this just pinch it but before you pinch it you're gonna want to add some glue there in between there just to fold it so it can hold in place your little pie crust there and I'm gonna add a little bit of glue here
is it for this pie? Berry pie. Okay, and what I did is I completely forgot was to slice, make some slices on top of your pie. I don't know if I'm still able to do this or not. If not, I'm just going to paint it and make it look because my berries are going to go in the center. Which I'm going to so take it out of here. And I am going to cut, let's see, you're going to need a cutter also. And let me cut, I'll cut it. I'm cutting my berries just at the tip. That's all I'm going to need. Maybe like around three berries or so. I think like three or four, four, probably four. I think I'm gonna use four. Okay, and that's all I need. Just like four of them. I'm going to end up putting these in the center right here. These are going to go like right here in the center. I'm going to glue these on now. Now before I added this top layer, I should have like sliced a little bit because I'm just going to add a little bit of paint on here where I slice it. It makes it look like the berry juice is just dripping right out of your pie. That's what I'm trying to do. And I'll do another cut over here on top of your pie. I'm just going to use a little brush on here and I'm going to be adding some purple paint to it so you'll need one of these knives also in order to cut that and I'm going to be using the purple Irish paint okay and I'm just going to add a, like a little squirt on here Right where I made my little slices, I'm just going to add a little paint there to make it look like uh, like my berry juice is leaking out of my pie. Okay. But you want to cut you want to cut your fabric slices before you add it to your pie. Not like the way I did it. I should have done this at the beginning, the very first. Okay, just a little bit like this is fine. You don't need a lot of the... Okay, and now once I have that done, I'm just going to go ahead and add my Mosh Posh to it on the top again. And I'm just going to put my paintbrush in here. So before I do that... I'm going to be adding uh, my Mosh Posh to this now. This pie, this pie actually is a lot, e <laughs> I would say it's a lot easier and a lot faster to, to make than it is for uh, the apple pie. 
because the apple pie you first have to cut all your slices and then you got to paint them and uh, and this one you just put the filling inside of it and you don't have to paint anything inside of it so this one's a lot quicker a lot faster to do and this you're just gonna do the same thing like you do the apple pie you're just gonna top it with your cinnamon and your refined glitter you're gonna add on it and, and that's it and then you're you're done doing this pie super easy nothing hard to make this pie but like i said just be careful with your fingers when you're putting the this uh, press on here because <laughs> You end up like me, burning your fingers. You're not careful. I should have put my my protectors on, my finger protectors to do this. But let me tell you, with the other pies I did, I did not burn my fingers with glue. So I don't know what's wrong with my glue gun today. Maybe it's just shooting out more glue than it's supposed to. Maybe that's what's going on or something. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Maybe it's time for a new one for me to get. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay, let's see. You just want to make sure you have enough uh, mosh posh on here and, and make sure. And afterwards, the, these pies, I'm going to end up spraying them with a, a clear, like a clear wax on them or clear uh, spray on them or something, you know, just so that way the sugar doesn't come, I mean, not the sugar, but the, the cinnamon and the glitter don't come off, you know, so it could stay on there permanent. So I'm going to spray them, but I need to, when I spray them, I'm going to have to spray this outside. Because of the fumes and stuff, I cannot spray this inside my house. So I'm going to be using like a clear mat from Rustolian. I think it's Rustolian, and you can get that clear spray at um, at the Walmart. That's where I got my spray at. So I'll, I'll have that put in on the on my uh, when I take picture you know I'll have a picture of it so you can know what kind of spray I'm using so in case you want to end up doing this and if you don't have that you can always uh, put some clear wax on top of it afterwards but I would prefer better the spray because I'm afraid if you put the clear wax on it afterwards I don't know your you might end up losing some of your glitter and some of your cinnamon on your pie, so it's better to spray it, I would say. Okay. I think that should do it for my glitter. I mean, for a little wash. But, so, but see, I kind of want to add up here too, because that way the cinnamon will fall right on there too, you know. this till you're satisfied how it's gonna you know how you want your pie and of course when I did the I did a little uh, berry pie I the other one I did I used red berries on mine on my other one so and you're gonna see purple and you're gonna see uh, the red berries which I'm going to be including the picture of my pies with these with this video so you can see I wish I had uh, brought them out and showed them to you before I had started this video okay once I have all this you can see how plenty of this wash posh on here okay and then now I'm going to go ahead and just add my whole Sprinkle it with the cinnamon now. 
and see how it shows purple on there don't worry because that makes it look like your uh, your berries uh, is dripping your pie so this is gonna be Okay, and now that I have it all on there, I'm going to go ahead and shake this down also and let this all fall out. <laughs> that way, whatever it didn't stick on there, you know, it's already off the your pie crust here. <laughs> And on this one, I think I'm going to be adding, I might be adding like a blue little ribbon on this one. A nice, uh, like a plaited ribbon I'm going to add to this. And a little tag to it that says berry on it. And my other one I'm going to put uh, like a red or pink, pink, more, more like a pink ribbon. And it's going to say uh, apple pie on it. Okay, and I hope you guys really enjoyed this this pie making today video because <laughs> I sure did enjoy it making these pies <laughs> when I first made them I was all excited making them I thought it was oh my god they, they smelled so good and they smell so real but yeah this is the way you make them so it's real simple it just if you make them just take your time making them <laughs> there's no rush <laughs> so I hope if you new on my channel here um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that like button and that notification so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos that I have I have some more videos I'm going to be doing so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thank you for watching. Bye-bye. I love you guys all. See you next time. Bye. <laughs>